everyone, welcome back to Beekeeping Like a Girl, or welcome to if you are new. Today I am going to be talking about one of the main use in beekeeping. So this is a hive tool. This is what it looks like. Uh, we use this every single time we get in a hive. You might see me using this in some of our videos. So I'm going to go ahead and explain to you how to use it and why we use it. So one of the reasons why we use it is because of propolis. Propolis is something that I will talk to you guys more about in a future video, but for now I will just tell you that it is basically a bee glue. So they use, they use it to seal everything, we use it to seal some boxes, the frames, um, and the frames we do have to get to, so this makes it easier, easier for us to get to it. So we have two hive tools here. This is another hive tool. They look a lot different actually, but I'm not gonna really show you how to use this because they're both used for the same thing. This one is the main, this is the common one. So I have a box over here that I'm going to show you guys how to use a hive tool and how I use a hive tool. a little bit closer so you guys you guys can see okay so there's a bunch of different things that a hive tool is used for so I'm gonna show you a few of those so I have a box here with frames all the stuff that you would have in a hive so I start by using the hooked side right here, and I go into this little like crevice right here sort of, and I go down and then kind of turn it a little bit and it separates the frames for me so that it is easier for me to get to them. So I'm going to go down and just twist it a little bit, and I like to move mine out of the way a little bit. This I do it at the top and the bottom. So I do it on one side and then I go to the other side and do the same thing. I don't move it as much, it's a good amount. And then I sit down my hive tool and I pick up the frame. So as you can see, that makes it a lot more easy for me to pick up a frame. So I will just do that throughout the hive throughout the frames, so it is so much easy, easier for me to get to the frames. So another thing that we use this for is scraping. So this is the part that we scrape it with. So if we have a bunch of propolis on the side that is making it uneven for us to put the lid on or the second box, we will take it, the flat side here scrape it. Or if we have some comb at the bottom that isn't supposed to be there, we could also scrape that. Same thing if there's comb on the top, we could also scrape that. And you can just really scrape anything that is kind of in the way for you and it's just really handy for that. But another thing that we use, if you have a two framed hot two boxes on a hive. Just make sure this is even here. So if you have uh, checked the, the top box and you want to check the bottom box, there's also a lot of propolis in between the little like hole right here that they fill with propolis. So I'm going to show you at the front here. So we always go to the corners and we take this flat side and we go under and pop it, pop it up. And then we do the same thing with the other side and pop that part off. And then we can take that box off and look at the bottom. Also, there is always a ton of propolis on this, this kind of lid. It's a inner cover. So we do the same thing. We go to the corners here and pop that. 
but you don't really actually want to pop it or else that can startle the bees. Also, one thing, as we are doing all of this, we want to make sure that we're slow and steady because we, like I said, we don't want to startle the bees. And we want to make sure we're not smashing any bees. We just, just we want to be careful still. But that is a couple of things that you can use the hive tool for. Thank you guys so much for watching. Follow along for more bee adventures. Be here next time on Beekeeping Like a Girl.